hello everyone and welcome to my youtube channel and in this video today we will see what to do if you get the error message such as windows socket registry entries required for network connectivity are missing while diagnosing internet connection problem so in this video we will see how to fix this if you will find this video helpful then please like share and subscribe to my youtube channel for more tips and tricks now what are windows socket at first windows sockets are the program that helps in communication between browsers ftp client software and the tcp ip protocols so generally we uh, we can say that if there is a problem in windows socket then you cannot browse the internet now windows sockets are the registries uh, you, which you will find in windows registry so if you want to see where is this windows socket let us see how to find it we'll go to registry for that one at first in order to run registry you need to be logged into your system as an administrator so let me press windows and r button and type res edit yes this so once you are into registry editor you will expand this hk local machine then you will go to system you will go to current control set then you will uh, expand services and you will scroll down and when you scroll down at the end, you will find this uh, windsock uh, where is windsock okay so windsock and windsock 2 these are the windows socket registry so if this windows socket registry if the value is corrupted or if it is deleted from the registry then you will get the error message as above so let us see how to fix this problem now if windows sockets registry is are deleted then you can download those registry for windows 10 so how you will download is you will go to this website techgrounds.com and uh, i will link this description i will link this website in the description box also so when you come here come to this website you can see download both windsock registry files below and you'll see the links here so what you'll do is you'll click on this link and you can see the windsock registry is downloaded similarly you will download the another uh, also and once you have downloaded both of this one you will just uh, run these values so when you run this then you'll have a new value for the windsock in the registry so once uh, you have installed this windsock and windsock 2 values then what you will do is you will click on start button right click on start button you will go to command prompt and admin now what we are going to do is after you have installed this windsock windows socket value we are uh, going to reset the windows socket so what you will type here is you will type n-e-t-s-h windsock and then reset then you will hit the enter button so you'll get a message that successfully reset the windows sock and you must restart the computer so before we restart the computer what we will do is we will uh, reset the ip ip settings also so for that one net n-e-t-s-h space then int ip reset so and then press enter this will also reset the uh, ip IP address settings so once you have done this one you will restart the computer and hopefully the error should be removed from the system thank you for watching this video and if you found this video helpful please like share and subscribe to my youtube channel for more tips and tricks